hear the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ, according to John. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. He was in the beginning with God. All things came into being through him, and without him not one thing came into being. What has come into being in him was life, and the life was the light of all people. The light shines in the darkness, and the darkness did not overcome it. There was a man sent from God, whose name was John. He came as a witness to testify to the light, so that all might believe through him. He himself was not the light, but he came to testify to the light. The true light, which enlightens everyone, was coming into the world. He was in the world, and the world came into being through him. Yet the world did not know him. He came to what was his own, and his own people did not accept him. But to all who received him, who believed in his name, he gave power to become children of God, who were born not of blood, or of the will of the flesh, or of the will of man, but of God. And the word became flesh and lived among us, and we have seen his glory, the glory of a Father's only Son, full of grace and truth. This is the Gospel of the Lord. In our service today, the response to you are the light of the world is let your light shine through. Child in the manger, vulnerable and holy, born of a woman, adored by the lowly, sharing your frailty to raise us to glory, and passion and rising, you transform our story. Father, we rejoice and sing, for you love us with a great love. We give thanks to you for the coming of our Saviour, Lord Jesus Christ, into our world and into our lives. You are the light of the world. Let your light shine through. Father God sent his Son to live as man amongst us. Let us pray in the confidence of our new life in him. Rejoicing in the birth of our Lord and Saviour, we pray that the Church may be continually reborn. We give thanks and pray for our ministers, Suze, Jonathan and Bishops Peter and Ruth, and for Father Philip in our Link Parish of Moanda, as we and them share in the humility of the manger, the adoration of the shepherds and the love of the Holy Family. You are the light of the world. Let your light shine through. Father, we give thanks for all who celebrate Christmas, all who are worshipping in churches <clears throat> across the world, for all who acknowledge Jesus in their midst. Father God, pity and pardon this world of conflict, deaf to the message of peace. Bring harmony where there is strife between nations and where people are divided by suspicion and bitterness. Heal those who have no peace within themselves. Bless the outreach and mission of your church. Give all to your people the courage to tell the gospel story and proclaim your presence and love. You are the light of the world. Let your light shine through. Loving Father, we pray for the families and friends with whom we celebrate this happy time. Give us true love, unselfish desires and grateful hearts. We pray especially for children, for their unclouded joy at this time. Create in us a pattern of human love that will lead them to the love of God who sent his son as a little child. 
comfort those who are alone, those that find Christmas a sad or lonely season, those for whom it brings memories or anxieties or dangers. Guide and strengthen those who are on duty over the holiday period. You are the light of the world. Let your light shine through. We pray for those who cannot feel the joy of Christmas through the burden of sickness or other distress. As we remember Bishop Peter, Wendy Harris, Keith Chapel, Anne Fenner. Send us to them to relieve their own loneliness, to ease their suffering and to cheer them. Grant your healing for those beyond our capacity to help. Comfort with your presence all who are separated at this time from those they love. Bring the light of Christ into their afflicted lives, as we also pray for those known personally to us, and name them now in our hearts, as we remember them now in a moment of silence. You are the light of the world. Let your light shine through. Father, have mercy on those departed, as we remember with thanksgiving those whose earthly labours are complete and commend them to your eternal keeping. Comfort those who mourn, give them mercy and peace, as we have a moment of silence for those whose anniversaries are at their time. You are the light of the world. Let your light shine through. God of grace and truth, hear our prayers and bring light to our hearts to resolve to follow you more clearly in this new year. Forgive the sins of past mistakes and bring to fruition the purposes of your love. You are the light of the world. Let your light shine through. Let us say together, Merciful Father, accept these prayers for the sake of your Son, our Saviour Jesus Christ. Amen. The world waits for a miracle The heart longs for a little bit of hope Oh, come Oh, come, Emmanuel The child prays for peace on earth And she's calling out from a sea of hurt Oh, come, oh, come, Emmanuel And can Amen. 